and little mortals meet by fight between already. And uh, I'm standing in front of the Safari Zone right now. We're playing Pokemon Heart Gold Randomizer Nuzlocke, and because Beast is here, that makes it a versus. Yes. That's your response. Just yes. <laughs> yes. I am currently fishing for Pokemon. Great. Ah! I can live with this. Hello, Armaldo. Huh. Neat. I should I not have like a level five in front of an Armaldo. I feel like there's people here that give you stuff. Okay, punishment. Doesn't that do more damage the more stat stages you have down? Uh, the more stat stages you have boosted. Okay, I hope... Armaldo is Bug Rock. Yes. I hope this judgment doesn't kill it. Alright, time to get six encounters that don't get modified by what Pokemon I have to catch them with. Oh no, Ancient Power? Ancient Power Punishment, Kyle! That's not a good combination. Because it's however many... Because Punishment does more damage the more stat stage bonuses that the thing you're hitting has. Okay. Well, it's like now basically I'm sad. It says it's uh, fuck sweepers. Yeah. Fuck those people who use Garchomp and just only only swords dance. Pretty much. Because right. I don't want to lose a Silvasaur, I feel the need to heal. Now let's see if I randomly run to a Geodude at the entrance. If you do and I don't. I will have a sad That's gonna be hilarious. I ran into a Geodude! Did you? Yeah. Did you really? Yeah. And then I run into a, a Dragonite, catch it, somehow, and I'm just like, I'm still mad. <laughs> I get more areas if I can catch this. Yeah! I get more areas. I'm catching an Armaldo right now, sir. <laughs> All these heavy balls are coming in use. This is redemption for me not getting any encounters at the beginning of the game because I kept kill them. Kept killing them. I don't know if that's my fault. Everything is balanced. Oh crap, I got that Spiro. Nothing's balanced anymore. Let's just, I have to lose two, two more Pokemon. Oh, by the way, I just I just got a starter, technically. Sorry, one more if I catch this. I yeah, technically just got a starter. Yeah, you did. I would love if this Armaldo would get captured. Your name is going to be Nugget. I just realized I've been using potions and, and this this the Silvasaur has synthesis. Yeah? Because potions always go at the first of the round. Yeah, but when it's a uh, fifty per when you have fifty percent of the opponent's levels on them. More than really. It's fifty-five percent. Stop using ancient power! Okay, I, I don't think that the Safari Zone's randomized. You go to another area. It's only Geodude. Oh! Oh! Pain! I went to another area and ran to a Rattata. Those are still captures. Yeah, it's still captures. It's just... Not as interesting. No, not as interesting. <laughs> we have these exotic rare Pokemon so far, so these are all common! 
Actually, these are rare. You're yeah. right. <laughs> hey, coughing. I don't remember if that was normally there. I don't know. Why won't you stay in the heavy ball? I don't think our ball is heavy. I'm pretty sure this bug rock is. I've only caught one of my six encounters. Hey, look, giraffe rig. Okay, time to... Does steel resist dark? I, I feel it does. It does until Gen 6, I think. So you're telling me that until Gen 6, as long as you were using a steel Pokemon, you could expect it to not die unless there was a fire move on the field. Or ground. No, right. no, not ground, because most steel Pokemon have a high defense, and almost all ground moves are not special. Uh, Earth Power? I said almost all. Can you tell me what in Generation 4 got Earth Power, aside from Heatran? In Gen 4? Yes. Near nothing. The, the Nidos. I said nearly nothing. Pretty sure, uh, Diglett might be able- not Diglett, uh, it's Evolve Form. Doug Trio might be able to get it, too. Okay, I see this Armaldo is going to be a problem. I'm going to use one more Heavy Ball. If that doesn't catch it, I am going to use- I think I have a Net Ball left. Alright. I've caught two- I've caught two of the four encounters I ran into. I got two more encounters left to go before I can change everything around and get more encounters. Okay. Mmm, Onyx, neat, interesting. Oh no, I had a lure ball, not a net ball. Ultra ball! The thing I only have two of, because as a backup. Ah yes, it didn't even shake. <laughs> this Armaldo is going to be the death of me. It's your expense, Steve. I think it's around the same area, too. Rest in peace, Expense Steve. Didn't he die in, uh... In Gym Wendy's 3? Gym. Yeah. Goldenrod Gym? Yep. So, uh, I'm gonna just go back to Heavy Balls. It's even got similar colors to Armaldo. STAY IN THE BALL! <laughs> what is waste... wrong with being in a ball? You're wasting all your heavies. I swear, Armaldo. I swear. And Tauros. I, I think we're halfway to this thing having no PP. <laughs> you know what? You want to be special? I'll catch you in a premiere ball. And I've caught half my Zavari Zone shit, but the important thing is I can unlock more areas. How many areas are there in total? I think there's like ten. So you get ten. four more. Alright, we'll try one more Ultra Ball. I have a feeling it's gonna end the same way the first one did. It shook once that time. Yeah, gee, I wonder why your Clefairy ran away from a wild for alligator. R Rando called me. <laughs> Clefairy versus for alligator. The ultimate showdown. Okay, Armaldo, Rain just wants to be your friend. Have a friend ball. The Geodude was holding a choice scarf when I caught it. My god, Kyle. We can't even farm that. And the Giraffe Rig was holding a TM. 
I really want to get a Pokemon of Thief or Covet. Yeah, Thief would be great. <laughs> yeah, we get those Focus Sashes from before. Geodude gets Iron Fist. All right, all right. Uh, I have used all of my hyper potions. All right, so Onyx is and, double immune to electric. And twenty. It has Volt Absorb. Motor Drive. Ah. Hey, it just wants to be fast. It's like light. Fast. It's like Lightning Rod. It's Mega Sceptile. Yeah, except it was already immune. <laughs> Instead of one fourth damage taken. Yeah. That that I'm I I see no reason why it should get lightning rod. Is it because it has that really long tail? Yeah. The one that doesn't go up into the air. Yeah. I I think there were some design flaws. Oh my god! Just get in! Just get in and fucking stay in! I have thrown half of my balls, if not more, at you! I have used all of my- all of my healing items of note! Why won't you just stay inside of a ball? Why can't you just stay? <laughs> Finally! <laughs> I just had to have a mini crisis. You had to waste all your balls on a single Armaldo. Rock bug, 150.4 pounds. Its enormous retractable claws can cut through most anything. Its entire body is clad in sturdy plates. It is 4 foot 11 and made of mostly stone and plates. <laughs> <laughs> Your name is Ice Baby. Mm. <laughs> no wait, no wait. I'm thinking of a different song. Your name is Can't Touch This. It's your expense, Steve, like I said. That was pain oh. and suffering. Oh no, that that girl just said that people compare her to a slow poke and I don't think that's a good thing. Are you saying she's dumb? I can buy quick balls now. Okay. I would say those are decent. But, but the best uh, ball in the game. I wouldn't say that. They're better than that. They're better than an Ultra Ball on turn one. On turn one. But if the thing has a 1% chance of... Or, sorry, a 5% ch chance of catching it, which would get exponentially better, assuming that you had weakened it first, then is it really better to just have one chance of that? Uh, with a Quick Ball, that 5% chance, though, on turn one is going to be a 20% chance. So it's going to be a 1 or 5 chance on turn one if it has a 5% catch. Right. Yes, but what I'm saying is it's not a very reliable cash source. It it is good to lead a battle with though. Oh Interesting. What's interesting? This Armaldo has flame body. Yeah, come back when you have a flame body vaporeon. <laughs> I mean, I have Snow Warning. I got... And there's a Wild Slowbro right here I can catch because it's Route 48. Not bad. Okay. Slowbro is actually a pretty good backup water type. Okay!
Right. I'm gonna pause the recorder real quick. Shring, if you want to walk, you can, and just ignore the route. There's the cliffside cave, which is like two rooms, but still. Uh, and then there's Route 48, which is what I'm capturing, capturing the slow bro on right now. Wait, wait, then, wait, 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 wait. Basically, 47 is water capture. Uh, Cliffside Cave is cave. And then Route 48 is uh, grass capture. It's just around the corner. Yeah. It's not just around the corner. It's like three routes. It is three routes away. It is three routes, and each route is like two feet long. Ah, so it's a it's a it's a capture fest. Yeah. It's great Leading up to the capture fest. Yeah, it's literally great for nuzlocks. This area is perfect for nuzlocks. What if they remade Gen 3 again, but also remade it to the point where the Kanto Safari Zone existed as well? That'd be wonderful. Because it'd be more capture. Oh, come on, slow bro, stay in the ball. <laughs> Beast, my game just crashed. Slow bro used agility. <laughs> It didn't actually crash, though. No, no. That would have been hilarious. Error cannot compute. <laughs> it's speed, bro. Oh, no. Slowbro is a great backup water type, though. Dude, psychic moves, gets ice moves, uh, it gets, gets flamethrower. Flame I think he gets... No, wait. I think he gets shockwave. That's kind of a meh move. It doesn't miss, though. Hello, old man. I'm naming you Oxymoron. Your name's gonna be Moron for short. Can I get an encounter in this cave? Does this count as my root encounter? The cave is cl it's called Cliffside Cave. Does this count as the root encounter? For Route 48? No. Okay, well, how am I going to capture this low-level Pokemon? Uh, I'll use this Quick Ball. <laughs> I say after I just talked to Kyle about it not being very reliable. Hey, look, it caught it! Yeah, you say it after you talk shit about Quick Balls. Uh, no, that's why I use it, Kyle. Yes, your name... That is a strange ability for a slow bro to have. Attack down, speed up. A strange nature, you mean? Yeah. Uh, but it's also got Cloud 9, which means it stops weather from happening. Now, do I fish this encounter, or do I surf? I want to surf. Yeah, that's the real question there. Let's lead with someone a little lower in levels. Prince! Alright, so if Arthur dies, I have Oxymoron. What is this encounter? That is a lantern. I have caught a lantern, and as such, dupes. Yep. You may invoke the ancient rite of dupes! So we will immediately get away. That is another lantern. Yep. Is this only lanterns? Are you surfing or fishing? Surfing. Cool. If this is still a lantern, I'm gonna fish. I just paused recording because somebody said something to me. Yeah, I know. 
first real recording Men's. session. Immense! Salamence? Really? Yes! <laughs> That's gonna be a bitch to catch. Uh, I've got... I've got 46 balls, so I think we got this. But it's level 10, so the only thing I can use against it is a Swellow. Hmm, interesting. I could have caught a Gardevoir in this quake cave, but instead I caught a Oddish. I know what I'll do. I'll switch to Shucky, and then I'll hail. And then I'll slowly nick him down. So I got this. This thing did five damage to something almost three and a half times its levels. Also, he has rough skin, so this works. I'm gonna catch this just in case I run into it later, but I don't want this. Okay, uh, with the hail and with the damage it's taken from rough skin, I think it's fine if I switch out to nebula. Oh, by the way, at the same place you can buy quick balls, you can also buy dusk balls. Yeah, now that's so a very reliable one if we ever recorded at night, which we should start doing that a couple times just because dusk balls this are this. Alright. This is like our first real recording session we've had in a week. Or two yeah, or three. Four episodes. I will use this, uh... I, I will use this love ball because I'm not- I'm holding off on the heavy and fast balls and the great balls until you are below half health. Ooh, ice punch! That's a dangerous challenge. <laughs> It could murder its own kind mercilessly. Glad I didn't run into this, though. Unown. Describing what you want to do with it. Unown it. <laughs> this is a very good encounter for me. I'm curious to see what its ability is. There's a PC at the, at the Safari Zone, too, isn't there? There's a Pokemon Center, yeah. Well, I'm flying back to Mr. Pokemon so I can get the experience share. I did that quite literally ages ago, episodes ago. Well, I didn't five have five episodes ago. Four or five. Well, Yet you walked back to, to get money from your mother in the game. Uh, and. That that is my rebuttal to your argument. I didn't have the scale at the time. Regardless, I caught it with the with the heel ball. It was a it half less health balls left. Than the yes. Yes, it did. It's the same height. It's uncontrollable. If enraged, it flies around, spouting flames and scorching fields and mountains. It's a dragon! It is also a female dragon. You have had a thing called Wrathmonger. Yes. Her name will be Wrath. Cause Salamence just seems to be an angry creature. <laughs> and they're both from Hoenn. Okay, so with that out of the way, you don't have to surf. You can can you surf through the route and get to the other side? No. Uh, before we end this episode, then I'm just gonna fly back and then see what this thing's ability is. I'm hoping huge power because it did a lot of damage. Granted, it was a Weavile. Yeah, granted, it was a shitty, weak Pokemon. 
Defensively weak Pokemon. What is your ability? Yeah, what is its ability? <laughs> I forgot Shell Gone had Poison Heal. So it has Poison Heal? Yeah. Not the worst ability. Well, no, it's pretty great. What is it? Heal like 1 16th health each turn when poisoned? I don't know. I don't remember. It has Night Slash, it has U-Turn, it has Head, Butt, and Ice Punch. All of its moves are 70 power or higher and 100 accuracy. Well, I'm flying back to the Safari Zone because between between this session and the next one we do, I'm going to be uh, grinding my shit to 30. And this is a great place to grind. Well, I gotta grind a dragon. Safari Zone's great. Hopefully the dragon has fire moves. Oh my yep. god, it'll probably be able to learn fly! <laughs> what do I get rid of? Head punch? My question is why are you complaining about my th my uh Vigoroth when you have two Owen pseudos? I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> This is actually very good thematically. Or, not really thematically, but for me. I like Hoenn. It's probably one of my favorite generations after Gen 2. Okay, the moment of truth. Can this dragon learn Spatial Run? It's just like, no. It can. Okay. This it's is like, going no. to be a high crit dragon here. It's like, no, what are you, stupid? Why would a dragon learn spatial rent? Get rid of headbutt. I might give it fly if uh if Prince ever dies. Can it learn rock wrecker? I don't know. Damn it. Can it learn needle arm? Alright, B, since you said we're about to end it off, I think it's uh, about time for that. I was waiting for you, because I didn't know when you were done with your safari shenanigans. I said I was just going to go back and wait here, because between... So, we will see you in the next video. Goodbye.